Scientists estimate that of the nearly 9 million animal species on Earth, only about 1.5 million have been identified and studied. Among the known creatures, there's incredible diversity in size. From the minuscule bumblebee bat, measuring just over an inch long and weighing less than a penny, to the massive colossal squid, which can grow over 45 feet long and weigh more than 1,000 pounds. While modern giants like the squid are awe-inspiring, prehistoric times saw an abundance of massive creatures, many of which dwarf today's largest animals. From land-dwelling behemoths to oceanic titans, the fossil record reveals that the ancient world was home to some truly gargantuan species. Join us as we dive into the fascinating history of Earth's biggest animals and explore the giants of the past. Quick reminder, if you're enjoying the content so far, make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon to stay updated with all our latest uploads. Now, let's jump right in. The Dinosuchus, an ancient relative of modern alligators, was a true titan of its time. This monstrous reptile reached lengths of up to 35 feet and tipped the scales at an estimated 5,000 to 11,000 pounds. Living during the Cretaceous period over 75 million years ago, it was the largest predator in North America and its fearsome size allowed it to prey on dinosaurs. Remarkably, the Dinosuchus was about twice as heavy as the Tyrannosaurus rex, making it a formidable apex predator. Research suggests these reptiles had a lifespan of around 50 years, with continuous growth during their first 35 years. Despite their incredible size, Dinosuchus closely resembled today's alligators and crocodiles, proving that some features of these fearsome reptiles have stood the test of time. The capybara may be the largest rodent today, but it pales in comparison to Joseph Artigasia monazi, the largest rodent ever known to exist. Living over three million years ago in what is now Uruguay, this prehistoric giant weighed an astonishing 2,600 pounds on average, nearly 20 times the size of a capybara. Fossils of J. monazi reveal large front teeth that likely served as multi-purpose tools, much like the tusks of elephants. These massive incisors would have been effective for self-defense against predators and for digging up food. Despite their size, the rodent's molars were relatively small, suggesting it fed on soft vegetation. What it lacked in chewing capability, J. Manizzi made up for with an incredible bite force, three times stronger than that of a tiger. These unique adaptations helped this colossal creature thrive in the lush estuaries and forested deltas of its ancient habitat. During the Pliocene and Pleistocene epochs, a massive ground sloth called Megatherium americanum roamed the woodlands and grasslands of South America, reaching lengths of up to 20 feet and weighing as much as 8,000 pounds. This giant herbivore dwarfed its modern relatives. Although primarily plant eaters, some researchers speculate that Mes americanum might have been opportunistically carnivorous under certain conditions. These sloths stood on their hind legs using their immense size and strength to reach high foliage that other animals couldn't access. Belonging to the suborder Xenarthra, home to today's sloths, armadillos, and anteaters, Megatherium had claws, unlike any sloth alive today. Instead of climbing trees, it used these large claws to dig holes and tunnels, likely for shelter or searching for food. This unique blend of size, strength, and adaptability made M. americanum a dominant presence in its ecosystem. Over 30 million years ago, Paraceratherium, a colossal, hornless ancestor of today's rhinoceroses, roamed the Earth. Weighing approximately 30 tons, it was as heavy as four modern elephants, measuring 26 feet long and standing about 18 feet tall at the shoulder. Despite its massive size, it had a surprisingly small skull. Equipped with a long neck and legs, Paraceratherium could browse treetops for leaves and branches that were out of reach for most other herbivores. Unlike modern rhinos, it lacked horns, but its teeth were uniquely adapted for feeding. The animal had two pairs of incisors, the lower ones angled slightly forward and the upper ones curved downward. This arrangement likely helped it grip and strip branches while feeding. To this day, Paracoritherium holds the title of the largest land mammal ever to exist, a true giant of prehistoric times. While many of the giant creatures from the past are long extinct, 
One incredible behemoth still roams the oceans today, the blue whale. As the largest animal to ever exist, blue whales can reach lengths of nearly 100 feet and weigh up to 200 tons, dwarfing all other known species, past or present. Their massive size requires an equally massive diet. According to a 2021 study led by ecologist Matthew Savoca, blue whales consume between 20 and 50 million calories a day, equivalent to about 30,000 Big Macs. Their primary prey is krill, tiny crustaceans they engulf in a single mouthful. Using baleen plates, blue whales filter out seawater while retaining the krill, swallowing thousands in one gulp. Witnessing a blue whale surface is a truly awe-inspiring sight, offering a rare glimpse of one of nature's most majestic and enduring giants.